today my experience in the park was very cute.、Mm -hmm. I walked to the park.、Mm -hmm. Today I didn't do exercise in our front yard.、Oh. I was going to stay there, but I felt that you know was a、uh, Like many days, I didn't go to the park myself. I wanted to have that tranquility of myself going to the park.、Mm -hmm. So I walked towards the park, and、uh, the park was like a very, you know,、uh, busy with、uh, people playing when I got in there. And then gradually, those people left. You know, they were doing the. I think the Spanish families they were doing the baseball. So when I went over there, they gradually all start to leave because it was starting to rain,、mm -hmm. like drips of rain. And I didn't hear about the little drops、mm -hmm. of rain, so I settled down. And the, the Fujianese, you know, the dancer,、mm -hmm. Mr. Zhen, right? He was always playing loud music and do the dancing,、mm -hmm. try to do、uh, you know fit, like health health and fitness program.、Mm -hmm. He was all by himself with a bike. And、uh, I think he was hoping more people to join him, but nobody came to join him. So、mm. he was alone there, and the drops of the rain got a little more heavy. So he also went home.、Mm -hmm. So I pretty much was left alone in the whole big park,、mm -hmm. and I started to do my Falun Dafa exercises.、Mm -hmm. So I finished the exercise one, and I finished the exercise two. Not really finished.、Uh, about half an hour, and it was、uh, six o'clock. Send forth righteous thoughts, Fajian Yan. So I sat down, and the moment I sat down, this American family showed up,、mm -hmm. and there、uh, are two fathers and three kids, three boys.、Mm -hmm. So they started to use the remote control to drive the big truck.、Mm -hmm. You know, it's like electric truck, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they were doing the remote control, and the two kids were running. With the truck, and the truck was constantly being driven in the most crazy way, violently rushing all over the place, very violent rushing.、Mm -hmm. And the entire base, base, baseball field was all stirred up with terrible dust. And the wind started to blow the dust and blew this way, blew that way. Pretty much, you know, was blowing all directions, but didn't blow towards my direction. So I was sitting by the baseball field and I was meditating. And the father says, "Watch out! Don't let the car hit the lady."、Mm -hmm. And the two kids continuously was running around and、uh, driving the car very crazy. And the car got flipped many times. The big truck got flipped, belly up many times. Very, very kind of like wild driving, and they didn't know how to manage it.、Mm -hmm. And the father was very loud and telling the child, "Don't walk. I mean, don't run around." Handle the car in the better way,、mm -hmm. and the children basically, you know, they didn't know how to do it. So、mm -hmm. the father was just yelling. The children was continuously making mistakes.、Mm -hmm. So I was there very tranquil.、Mm -hmm. We can go. I was there very tranquil.、Mm -hmm. I meditated,、mm -hmm. but、uh, they were not stopping.、Mm -hmm. So I, in my mind, I thought. Mm -mm. This is not very polite. They saw me meditating, but they continue to be very loud.、Mm -hmm. And the father doesn't know how to educate the children. And、uh, the father should really tell the children not to do that anymore because that was really too long for you know、mm -hmm. making a big mess. And that was all dusty and blowing, and the joggers all had to run away.、Mm -hmm. So. I didn't say anything. I continued to do my fajian yan, and then suddenly, boom! The car shooting right towards me,、mm. and、uh, really shooting towards me from my back, and and、uh, passed me only this much distance,、mm. and、uh, knocked out my shoes、mm. because I was sitting on the floor, and one of the shoes was on one side of the map,、mm -hmm. the other shoe was on the other side of the little, you know,、uh, scarf、mm -hmm. that I put on the floor. And a white shoe got blew up and flew right out,、mm -hmm. and the car basically almost hit me. Only this little much missed, and、uh, no apology.、Mm -hmm. The father had no apology,、mm -hmm. and the, just telling the kids to watch. Did I tell you not to do that? Look, you almost hit the lady.、Mm -hmm. He only said that. Didn't say anything apology.、Mm -hmm. So I stopped. My、uh, sending forth righteous thoughts, 
they were probably about 60 meters away from me. So mm -hmm. I spoke pretty loud. I said, excuse me, you're the parent, you're the wrong. Mm -hmm. You are the one that you're supposed to tell your children to do the right thing. And when they are doing all the things wrong, you only just talking to them and don't help them. And uh, this is not correct. Stop mm -hmm. doing that anymore. Mm -hmm. And uh, I heard of the children, the father says, uh-oh, that lady is yelling at you guys. I told you, you see, now she's yelling at you guys. I was like, no, I didn't yell at them. I yell at you. Mm -hmm. So I put on my shoes. I walked towards, right to, to the father. Mm -hmm. The two fathers, they were all sitting there was two American fathers mm. and uh, two three American children mm -hmm. and uh, the elder probably is about eight years old and the, the younger ones are probably about six and then the little one is about three mm -hmm. so two daddy and three three children mm -hmm. so they were all a little embarrassed I walked over I first talked to the dad I said excuse me you're the parent I was not yelling at the children but I want you to know something this is not correct this is our community you know, uh, playground. And um, it's okay you have fun, but when you're having fun, you also need to be considerate of other people's feeling. Mm -hmm. I'm meditating over there and you guys make so much louder noise and then make so much louder dust and then the car rushing towards me, you know? Mm -hmm. I said, this is very dangerous. You cannot do that in this community. You need to be more considerate. Mm -hmm. The father doesn't even look at me. He was so embarrassed. He was like, See, I told you guys, don't do that. No. You know, look, I said to the children, I said, listen, I said, I didn't yell at you guys, okay? Because I'm very loving. I love you guys. They, they, were, they were all red faced. They were all very embarrassed and the little hands were you know, touching their ears and, the, and the, the, they were kind of nervous. Mm -hmm. Really cute kids, very cute children. So I said, uh, I noticed the eyes are all have a little like a uh, mm -hmm. black bag. Mm -hmm. Very obvious they don't sleep well. Mm -hmm. The mother is not wisdom. The two kids are very cute, but the eyes all have black bags. Mm -hmm. uh, very obvious is too much activities and not sleeping well. Mm -hmm. And uh, so I said, I love you guys. It's okay you come out to have fun, but uh, do you understand that you know, you need to really control the car. Nice, not to be too rough. Mm -hmm. And then make the car drive nicely, not to always belly up. Mm -hmm. I said, your daddy probably worked really hard to make the money and to buy you the toy. But if you don't, you know, have patience and don't do it nicely, the car will be destroyed very soon. Mm -hmm. So you need to take care of your toy too, correct? They were like, yes. And uh, so I said, okay, let's shake hands now. So they all gave me their hands. So we shook hands. Mm -hmm. And uh, the father was happy. And the other father was listening very carefully. Mm -hmm. And so I said, uh, I now I know your name. You are DJ, the elder one. And you are Anthony. And I said, yeah. I said, now you also need to know my name now. So I showed them the lotus flower. I said, I'm Dr. Lotus, right? Mm -hmm. Uh, they were all very happy and uh, and the little three-year-old called Eric the father was always listening nicely and I said Eric you are the best you're very nice and quiet and you're learning and so the father says yes uh, I was tell I was trying to teach them something but they he said these days all the kids if you tell them six times they don't even listen so I decided that I will let you teach them. I noticed that you teach them, they are listening to you now. Uh, I then, at the moment, I was very moved. I realized that, you see, he was loudly talking to the children. That lady, you know, not make sure don't drive towards her direction and things like that. He actually had this intention that as if, you know, so I said, oh, you mean you want me to teach them? He said, yes, because I cannot teach those children. Mm -hmm. 
but you can teach them mm -hmm. and your words get into their head and they are willing to listen to you the father start to say like that so the children start to turn around to the father says can we learn chinese from her <laughs> yeah i did ask them i said do you like chinese food yeah we do okay so and then they turn around to the dad can we learn chinese from her i said good i'm gonna teach you guys something today so the father lined them up and I said, I'm teaching you three words today. I teach them zhen shan ren. In that yard, I taught many children these three words in Chinese. Truthfulness, compassion, forbearance. And the father, the two fathers were learning, the three children were learning. They all learned and they say, the elder son, DJ, pat on his father's chest. Dad, I think you need that. <laughs> so cute, you know. So eventually they took my name, uh, business cards. And uh, so the father's name is Joey and Eric. Yeah, Eric's father is also Eric. So, and the three, three boys is uh, DJ, Anthony and uh, Eric. So I met these three people today. We continue this way here. So I said, we're neighbors, right? I said, I'm right in this neighborhood. They said, yeah, we are neighbors. In our neighborhood. No, it's not in our building. The other building? I don't know, but I'm talking about in the playground. I met them in the big playground, not in front of the building. So they are in this neighborhood. 